2026 running back Ray Guillory Jr. gets three touchdowns in the second half. Ray, talk about the change in the second half. I think your offensive line started to get some cohesiveness. And you took advantage of that. Um, just knowing coming out second half, I got to be legendary. Got to be different, you know. D them dogs came out to fight. I had to turn into a dog to be ready to fight back, you know. In the offensive line, I was just using them being so over aggressive and just replacing where they was at, you know. It's, it really just simple. We just slow it down. Talk about that final touchdown, a little pitch from Beard. You cut across the middle. You take it to the house. Yeah. You get in the end zone in the corner. Speak on that a little bit. Uh, that play before the play, I told him I grabbed him. If you if y'all go back and watch, I'm like check arrow. I told him to check it because I'm knowing they was they weren't gonna come pick me up. And so when when I seen him fl fake flicking, I'm like, bro, I know he ain't gonna run. He flick it to me, and I just see open field. So I'm a playmaker. I'm gonna make plays in open field. I just cut it back across because I knew they was going to run all the way over there. And so just backyard football, basically. One of the best playmakers you heard in the state of Texas, 2026 running back. The best. The best. The best. Racine Guillory Jr. right here is Alito takes the victory, 42 to 27. One of the top pass catchers in the 2026 class in yes, Texas, Caden Finley. Alito comes out on top, 42 to 27. The second half was a big, big rush for you guys. Tell me what kind of adjustments you made at halftime. Uh, so just going into halftime, we we're a little down on ourselves, but uh, you know uh, we're a great team. We bond well, so uh, during halftime, you know we just got it right. Coaches got it right, and we believe in ourselves, and we just went out there and put BTA. Come now, on, you were facing probably double teams most of the night. Yes, Talk sir. about the patience that you had in beating those double yeah, teams. Yeah, so I had to be a little patient because I knew they were going to have safety over the top in the corner press, but uh, it didn't really affect me much. I don't let that get in my head, so just go out there and ball out. Now, what does this win mean for you guys going forward? You guys really don't lose at home. Now you go for you still got Richland in this district. Talk about that a little bit. Yeah, so uh, that was a that was a big district win, um, but uh, we got to move on. Uh, come back next week, uh, faster, stronger, get ready for Granberry, and then uh, get rested up and healthy for the bye week, and then uh, come back and do it all over again. Caden Finley, a couple touchdowns on the night. Alito gets the win, 42 to 27. Yes, sir.